I thought that for two periods we, we dominated play. I thought that was one of our best performances for two periods of play. Um, got out to a uh, 5-1 lead and then uh, they, they got a little energy after getting a couple of goals and give them credit. I think, you know, we just talked in the locker room quickly that give the league credit. Every single team in this league at, at a drop of a hat can turn it on, score three, four goals. Uh, so give Kanisha's credit for uh, battling back there. Obviously made it pretty interesting to get in that 5-4, uh, but good for our power play tonight that's been struggling to pick us up and go for two, two for four on the night. We're going to need that moving forward. Yeah, he's, you know, he had one goal last year, and I believe that might have been his seventh or eighth already this year. And, um, you know, he did a good job over the summer. He's, he's something that he's continuing to work on. Uh, so I'm happy with his development and the way his game's heading. Yes. Yeah, uh, you know, play Thursday, Friday, early, uh, late in the year like this, it's a quick turnaround. And, you know, I actually thought in the third period that we got pretty heavy in our legs, some of our guys, um, you know, so I think we're going to have to do a good job of staying committed here in the next few days to recover um, and, and be ready to go. It's going to be a tough matchup to head into uh, Niagara. Dwyer is always a tough building to play in, uh, so we've got a big task ahead of us, so we've got to be prepared. No, I mean, obviously, anytime there's a goalie change mid-period, you're, uh, you're trying to get as many pucks on him as, as fast as possible. He's coming in cold. He's probably not mentally prepared or fresh to get in there. Uh, so, you know, they, we didn't change our game plan so much as, you know, try to get the next three or four shots on net quickly here and let's test them out.